Okay, so there's quite a few different ways you can do this question. Um, I'm going to find out length CB and then I'm going to, from that, find out length CE. Um, so this question asks us for length CE. Now CE is the length that's shown at the bottom here. This is CE here. Okay, so that's the one we're trying to find. Now I'm going to first of all find out what CB is. Now what I'm going to do is just label this X and I realize that it needs to be uh, trigonometry because this is a rectangle, that's a right angle. So I'll need to use trigonometry for it. So we've got opposite and we've got the hypotenuse. So we're going to use a uh, sine. So S-O-H. So it's going to be a uh, sine 68 equals 27 over X. And I'm going to times both sides by x and divide both sides by sine 68. So that gives me x equals 27 over sine 68. And so if I do that on the calculator, 27 over sine 68. And that gives me 29.1204. And I just do a, a few more. Um, decimal places than usual because it's not an answer and you should never round your working out. Um, if it's asking for one decimal place, I think four decimal places should be enough. Um, but I'm going to try and keep it into the calculator if I can. So the next thing I need to do is work out um, CE. Now I'll need this angle here, which actually I can just take away 68 from uh, 90 because it's a rectangle, the whole thing will be 90 degrees. So I'm just doing 90 take away 68 which is 22 so that's 22 degrees um, now I'm looking for this one so CE I'm going to call CEY and I've got so what have I got I've got the um, adjacent here so this is now the adjacent and I've got the hypotenuse because this is opposite the right angle so this time I'm going to be using cos, so it's C-A-H, so cos 22 equals um, x uh, equals my 29.1204 blah 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 over y. So again I'm going to times both sides by y and divide both sides by cos 22, so y equals 29.1204 blah 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 over cos 22. Now I kept that in my calculator so I can just press divided by cos 22. Press equals and it's 31.4074 blah 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 and it says it wants the answer to one decimal place so it's going to be 31.4 now, um, if I lost you a little bit because I went quite quickly through trigonometry, this is a kind of question you do when you're quite happy with trigonometry. There's loads and loads of videos on the site that go through right from the basics of trigonometry. Um, if you want to do these questions completely within the trigon trigonometry triangle, then that's absolutely fine. You'll get the same answer.